dear student hope you are doing well we hope that all of you have a peer for the mock test through dakshna scholarship test app and know how to use the app now let's go to the process of final test first comes to the admit card log in to scholarship.dakshna.org to download your admit card currently when you open the app you will read that the test is yet to be scheduled it will be visible as soon as it is scheduled by dakshna the test will be visible from one day before the scheduled date of examination read the best practice banner and click on download button downloading might take time the exam day process will be explained by my friend as soon as you reach the test center open your app and click on i have reached the test center at 10 am put your phone on the flight mode and click on start button to start exam you will require an otp which will be given by the invigilator in the test center enter the otp and start your exam before finally starting the exam carefully read the instructions given and then click on i am ready to begin the test center fees will be exactly similar to the ones in the mock test and psts however listen to the instructions carefully in your details column you will see your personal details and exam details in test snapshots and instruction you will see marking scheme instructions and the status of questions that is answered unanswered and mark for review in the test section column you will see the names of the subject you can click on a particular subject and attend its quiz on the bottom of the screen you will see four buttons first one is save and next you can click on this button to save a particular question and move on to the next one or to skip a particular question and move on to the next one the second is mark for review and next it is for the questions you wish to review later the third one is clear response if you have filled in response and you want to clear it then click on this button fourth one is test summary in this you can see how many questions you have answered unanswered or marked for review and the arrow key back arrow key is to move to the previous questions once you have completed the test click on test summary option scroll down and click on next you will see a pop up that will show a message that if you click yes you won't be able to come back to the page so be very careful in clicking yes when you go to the submit page you will see two options submit online and submit offline to submit online apne mobile ka data on kariye apne mobile ko flight mode se hataiye data on kariye and click on submit online if you face some internet problem you can also submit offline to submit offline click on submit offline then it will carry you to the main page of the app and you will see the option show qr code click on that option to generate the qr code let this qr code be scanned by the dakshna representative at your test center also use the option save to gallery in case dakshna may require this qr code later please note that if you have submitted the test online there is no need to generate the qr code and if you have submitted the test either online or offline it will show test submit now you would have completed all the steps for the scholarship test thank you and wish you all the best Oh, <laughs> my